Well, we always knew that this would be a fairly distressing trial process in terms of the evidence that we would be hearing, but it has been particularly difficult over the past couple of hours, uh, especially within the last half an hour as the jury was showing, uh, showing CCTV images, some of them still, others moving off uh, the moment in which Lee Rigby was knocked down allegedly by the Crown uh, by a vehicle containing the two uh, defendants in this case. Now, Lee Rigby's mother and other family members left court, uh, his mother in tears and other family members very distressed as well, not as they saw the video of his final moments, but actually as they saw some CCTV images of him a little earlier, uh, walking down the street towards uh, the army barracks wearing uh, his normal clothing uh, and a Help for Heroes uh, top. Now, the Crown alleges that he was targeted by the two defendants, that as he crossed the road next to the barrier, uh, next to the barracks, uh, he was knocked down. And the video that was played to the jury uh, showed a, a Vauxhall Tigra car. Uh, we're told that was the vehicle uh, that was owned by Michael Adebalaggio, uh, pursu uh driving up at speed and then knocking um, Lee Rigby over. He is seen on the video uh, flying into the air over the bonnet and landing a couple of feet in front of that vehicle. The Crown prosecutor then goes on to tell the jury uh, about the attack itself, a horrendous attack, he said, uh, where both the defendants left the vehicle with common purpose, uh, carrying a meat cleaver, knives, uh, and one of them carrying a revolver as well. Uh, the jury was told that Michael Adebalaggio, who was carrying the meat cleaver, had made a serious attempt and almost succeeded uh, in decapitating Lee Rigby. There was then more very disturbing video that was shown to the jury uh, of it's alleged the two defendants then pulling Lee Rigby's uh, lifeless body from the point where that vehicle had knocked him into the air, into the roadway. Uh, you can see other vehicles uh, in the roadway and eyewitnesses just looking on as uh, this terrible attack has taken place.